Hello, in this video tutorial we will learn how to develop a business application using Samba. This business application will allow Tommy Company and Cal Poly Pomona to combine their databases together to retrieve vital information even though they both use different operating systems. We will merge two databases together using Access 2007. One database file will be in the Samba share we created earlier and the other database file will be in Windows Server 2008. We will join these two databases together and extract information that Tommy Company could use to hire new employees. Let's begin by opening Access 2007. Once Access is opened, click on the office icon and open the database file that is already created. The file name should be agency underscore database. When the file is imported, double-click on the table to the left to open it up and view the information. As we can see, the database contains an employer ID, employer name, employee position, and major field. Now we can import the database file that is in the Samba share. To do that, we click on the External Data tab, then click on the Access icon. Then we click on the Browse button and navigate to the database file in the Samba share. It should be called School underscore Database. Make sure the import tables, queries, forms, reports, macros, and modules into the current database option is checked. Then click OK. Now highlight the school object and click OK. We do not need to save import steps. Click Close. Now we can see the two databases, one that resides on the window machine and the other on a Samba share. To query them to get relevant information, we click on the Create tab. Then click on the Query Design icon near the right-hand side. When the Show Table window pops up, select both of the tables with the Shift key and click Add. Then we drag the Major field in the Agency database to the Major field in the School database. Now we select the relevant information that Tommy Company needs in order to contact students to hire them. Select Employee Position, then select Major. then student name, then phone number. Go to the Query 1 tab and right-click on it. Select Datasheet View. Now we can see a join table that tells us what position a student can be hired in based on the majors of the current employees. It also displays contact information in case Tommy Company wants to contact the students they are interested in. We hope you enjoyed this video tutorial.